gonna try to get a few people in the chat room before I get out the car. Um, yeah, I'm gonna actually park because, um, yeah, I think I'm gonna be okay. <laughs> I don't know. So yeah, we got. So we got. Um, let me double tap real fast. We got people, you know, just sitting waiting for work. They're gonna approach me. Um, and this is actually near like a nice. Um, this is near a uh, like a nice area, <clears throat> so it like devalues the property. There's the uh, houses. There's all the houses right there that they put up for um, that they live in, you know. And yeah, sometimes they work, but you know, like they just basically wait. I mean, they're everywhere. Look, this is like during the morning. You know, like I know they're like they'll approach you trying to sell drugs. Look at them over there, like just walking around. I mean, this is not the United States. This is not the United States. Um, I don't know if Trump sees this or not. Um, I'm actually gonna walk around. I don't think they're gonna do anything, <clears throat> you know? I'm not saying all of them are violent, you know, but I'm saying all of them suck money from anyone who, you know, works or tries to do, you know, better. And, and, and doesn't even really matter. Like, maybe they do work hard. They shouldn't be here, they're illegal. Like. You, you know, they're trying to, and these, these people have food stamps too. That's the funny thing. I've been asked to, to um, get food stamps here before. Let's see them. See them crossing the road over here. They have bags of food. You know, I mean, this is that, you know, La Dona, Atlanta. I mean, the, so these places aren't even called like, oh, of course there's going to be a coin laundry. Yeah, free. No one, no one ever talks about this. Illegal aliens get free housing, free food, free food stamps, all this. I'm gonna, um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk. Let's see what happens. I'm actually gonna get out the car and walk. Um, you know, I don't really care if I, I don't think, I don't think they'll be, um, I don't think they'll do anything. We'll see. That. Excuse me? Workers? Workers? Yeah. Uh, no. Nah. Nah. How, how long y'all stay here to work? From the morning. The morning? Nah. Nah, I just, I don't, I don't need any work right now, but I appreciate it. Thank you. So he's getting asked for money right now by this guy. I'm gonna walk uh, up over this way a little bit. Show you the little shopping center. See the difference in the trash? See, they don't. They like. They litter. Like no, no shit. They litter. See all the trash? Look at this. It's for a school project. It's for a school project. Georgia State. Huh? Georgia State. Oh, okay. I'll show you my ID. Yep. Bye. Bye. Okay, they asked me who I was They asked me who I was videotaping, so I'm probably about to have to head out. Delgado. Um yeah, I'm gonna hop back in my car. I'm hopping back in my car. I'm getting a lot of uh, a lot of heat already. Hold on, I'm across the road really fast. Yeah. They started saying who, who I was videotaping and all this, uh, so I'm gonna have to get the hell out of here. Anyways, you know, you saw all the trash and all that stuff, you know, oh, they're so clean, they're so nice, you know, they're such a net benefit to our economy and all these kind of things, you know. That's the kind of stuff you hear on CNN. Like, <clears throat> they're a net benefit. I'm not, I didn't come out here to try to make fun of other people or anything like that. I just wanted to get an actual idea of, you know, I'm sure everyone on this page already knew this, but, you know, I just wanted to, because I don't think, 
you know, Trump's even trying to deport people. Here's another place right here. Let's see. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can get a clear. Uh... This is the government housing. And this is right next to nice, like, like half a million dollar homes, right? So they totally bring the property value down. Uh, cruising through. Yep. Well, I'm about to go ahead and cut it off. I didn't want to, you know, do this for too long. I mean, look at this. And this is all free. This is all free housing for these people for the most part. You know? And then just, you know, there's plenty of more around here. <clears throat> you know, so this, I don't see them going anywhere. You know, like, I, I, Trump's like, oh, we're going to deport these people. Like, I, like... I don't see, I, I, I had the same experience that I had a year and a half ago seeing these people everywhere, trash everywhere. It's not getting any better. And like, like all you guys know, they breed at like a what, uh, a birth rate of, you know, the difference between, um, uh, a lot of times between Hispanics and people of European descent, they don't uh, think like, how are they going to afford these children? You know, like a lot of whites and, you know, we think like, how are we going to afford these children and we won't have them? These people just spit them out three or four at a time you see him walking down the road with five kids you know even if the dad is making twelve dollars an hour you know I, I don't know so anyways everything's in sp everything's in Spanish look see mom's at home with a kid, you know, even if dad's ma even if dad makes fifteen, say dad makes twenty dollars an hour, that can still not afford for housing, brand new shoes, cell phone in her hand, iPhone seven, kid's got a brand new haircut, brand new Michael Jordan shoes, you know, this shit just doesn't add up. If we deported every single illegal here, we could probably do healthcare and education right now. And I mean, I'm not even necessarily would be for that. I'm just saying, you know, we could we could probably do that. This little get quick shop, yeah. Oh, at nighttime, that place right there is absolutely like just crime ridden. And then we got more. We got more over here to the left. Anyways, thanks guys for watching. Um, uh, I just wanted to do this. It was kind of, you know, bothering me just because I, I was like, well, maybe Trump will, you know, maybe they'll, maybe they'll go eventually. Give them about six months. Give them a year. They're still here, so I don't know. Um, whatever. Um, yeah, this, these apartments just see now. Now we're actually, now we're actually getting off into a, like a nicer area. Well, th these are these are bad areas too, but it gets it gets nicer, and then literally. About a half a mile down this road right here to the right, you have really nice, you know, neighborhoods clean, but they put these uh, government houses, houses like a half a mile, a half a mile away. So, I mean, like, you know, it's just like you can't get away from these people. Just because you live in a gated community, it doesn't matter. They're coming to a uh, neighborhood near you, so. Thanks.